Hi everyone, my name's Mad Matt Lugos and welcome back to Metro Exodus, the Two Colonels DLC. We're here with Colonel Klebnikov. Uh, we're three months prior to the events uh, we're, uh, with, with Miller and Artyom. So we're, we're in full-blown war here with the rebels or with the rebellion, uh, with the people who are going to die anyway, really, because there's no more green stuff left. Soldiers here wounded. Oh, I imagine we're going to be in full full battle here. Colonel, sir. Hold your horses. I've missed two books. God damn it! The uh, <laughs> an investigation report to Oscom Special Department Investigator Pereplachik. Why I? Even cursory examination of the bodies reveal classic symptoms of medium severity radiation sickness in most of the rioters. Hemorrhages, atrophic lesions of skin and mucous membranes, hair loss, etc. Judging by the severity of symptoms, they stopped talking to the radio protector over a month. Stop taking the radio protector <laughs> over a month ago. It's impossible to narrow it down more, though. As to do that, I'd need to know the stations where they'd been spending most of their time at, at during that period. I swear the translation's a bit off at times, but I deem conducting autopsies unnecessary as I simply don't have enough personnel available. I've got radiation sickness, guys. Hair loss is a symptom. Thank you, soldier. Hey! Slava, I'm sorry about that. I know you had no choice. <laughs> Had I said nothing, they would have never believed they found the door. Under the bridge. Neither I nor you had a choice in this, Petrovich. Good luck to you two. See you on the train. Thank you. Dude, that was three months ago. Get over it. Hello, Colonel, sir. Glad to see you back. Give me some explosives, kid. Um, I should really just spend all my resources, right? Oh, it's full. So is that. Okay. Never mind. <laughs> all right. Hello there, soldier. Prisoners. It's not the general. I can't read Russian. Well, don't stand around. Man the defenses. Yes, sir. Crap. It's war then. This is for Kirill. Give me this. Give it me. Oh. We can hold them! We just need to hold them up till the reinforcements arrive! Listen here. The engineers are all down, but the charges are set. We have to reach the detonation device and use it. Lieutenant, I'll take the detonator. Give me cover. Yes, sir. Covering fire. Attention. Covering fire for the colonel. No saving ammo. Roger that. Ah. Kill them all. What did do? You said covering fire. 
Ah, uh, I've never been in the army, you can tell. Where do you want me to get Attention. to? Covering fire for the colonel. No saving ammo. Roger that. Oh, this is full war. Oh! Jesus! We've got to cover, sir! Get the detonator! Oh, covering me, are you? For God's sake, they're telling me to move forward. <laughs> alright, alright, concentrate. Concentrate, Matt. Oh, what? I've got to do all this again. Alright, F5, Matt. I shot you. We've got you covered, sir. Get that detonator. You haven't got me covered. covering anyone buddy am i going the wrong way i must be going the wrong way attention covering fire for the car no saving ammo Roger that. how are you not dead Wait for that to pull our wall, apparently. A mole man. No. 
Uh, murdering our own people, man. That's what it's come down to. It's going to be interesting to see how Klebnikov ended up dying, because it was only, what, two, three weeks before Artyom and Miller got there that he died. Or possibly died. What have we done? What have we done? Come in, HQ. Klebnikov here. HQ here. One charge didn't work. Damn. Fall back to Sibirskaya and stop them there. I've got no one else to rely on. Roger that. Over and out. Fall back. Colonel, sir, they blew the airlock and are coming down from the surface. Colonel, I have to be here, sir. Oh, that's, that's a friendly. Sorry, mate. Me up, soldier. Sorry for shooting you repeatedly. Come on, fellas, let's get out of here. Wow, I'm failing here. Jesus. Come in, HQ. Oh, man. Klebnikov here. F5, Matt. HQ here. One charge didn't work. Damn. Go back to Sibirskaya and stop them here. I've got no one else to rely on. Roger that. Over and out. Flamethrower alone.
Boys, hook me up. over <laughs> how are they so heavily armed if they're if you know if oscom have all like all the guns all the all the like trained arm pa uh, uh, trained forces Can you walk, sir? I will try. What's going on? <laughs> oh, the gas in us. Bastards! They're using gas! Get out, everyone! Gas! It's gas! Hold on, sir. I'll help. Just hold on. Oh, man. I'll report to the general. I think you're gonna make it, buddy. General, sir, there's been what? They're shooting us for being cowards and coming back. <sighs> Operation successful. Pawns are all dealt with. Ready for evacuation. What do you mean? Already left. Uh, what? What's going on? Recovering oh, no, evacuation. Evacuation? But you just killed everyone! Soldiers, civilians! Nobody left to evacuate! Slava! There's only enough green stuff left to evacuate the leadership! Everyone else is doomed! Gas was used just to cut the agony short. So you knew it. You knew it all along, you motherfucker! <coughs> Did I have a choice? And what difference does it make now? They made a mistake leaving me. <coughs> Petrov! Petrov! The fuckers left with ours! Get Seryoga on the line now! What? Dead? Sir Yoga? Son? Now listen to me. There's an RPG in the gun cabinet. Get it and rush to the old crossroads. Blow the fuckers up there. Go! <laughs> so, what do we do now? <laughs> Whatever. I had enough. <laughs> An evil bald guy, who would have thought? So long, Slava. Oh! <coughs> Saw no way out, I suppose. Fair enough. What a mess, what an absolute mess. I mean, we already knew this is what happened, but... Get ill. Dad? Dad! Uh, Uncle Tolia? Did he just kill himself? Why? Don't look there. I'm sorry I broke your order. There was a shooting at the station. Then it all went quiet. And he didn't come. I was worried. And I went looking for you. Listen. I told you earlier. Who should be told the truth, and who should not? Forget it. 
It's not for us to decide. And if you're being fooled, it's never for your own good. That's why he's dead. I... I understand. Good. And now... Let's go home, son. Are we, are we gonna see three weeks? Maybe need filters for this. Don't make me deal with more librarians. <laughs> Let's back with Miller. I imagine we'll get one more flashback to see how he and how Klebnikov ended up dying in the uh, in the institute. Oh wait, where did Miller go? It wasn't the institute, was it? That's where Artyom went. Kirill, Miller here. I'm at the bunker entrance. Roger that, Colonel. You'll be off the grid inside, so please, be careful. I will, Kirill. Miller, over and out. Oh, we're getting to control Miller. Pine, this is Alder. Come oh, in, no. over. Alder, this is Pine. Private, I'm at the bunker's door. I'll be off the grid while I'm down there. Don't know how long. When is the next scheduled radio contact? Keep it sharp, Colonel. The battery? Keeping it charged. The door? Locked. I'm eating the liver too. It's burning the slime, and I don't go to the dirty stations ever. Dad, you want the whole cheat sheet for me. I'm reading off it now. You do just that. Reading helps you remember. That's all, Pine. I'm going offline. Roger that, Elder. Pine, come in. Over. Pine here. Over. I love you, son. A whole lot. Uh, I love you too, Dad. And I want you to eat that liver without fail, over and out. Torch. Oh, we got the flamethrower. Well, it's not got all the mods on it. For God's sake. Okay, we're going to be dealing with worms in here, right? Let's have a read. Stalker's diary. Colonel's off his rocker. He wants us to go back to the comm center and get more maps so that the brass in the HQ could sit around looking important. Nobody cares if we catch a couple of lethal doses each looking for these sh if we're looking for the stupid things. That bunker is bad news. Radiation's so high the guys call it the egg boiler. Then there's the mutants too. Most of them are nothing special but there have been sightings of blind giants. No! <laughs> Probably the reason several groups went missing. The place sucks, just like this mission. At least they're giving us enough green stuff. That's got to count for something, especially nowadays. Great, 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 great. Let's attract some attention. Oscom soldiers, you have accepted their mission of absolute secrecy and utmost importance. To recover a map of a region with tolerable levels of radioactive pollution from the satellite community center's archive. Circumstantial data suggests that special attention must be paid to maps detailing Lake Baikal. So far, our efforts have been consistently proving fruitless. But now, you must be successful, no matter the cost. I can't disclose the ultimate goal of this search at the moment, but I'll have you know that lives of all the Metro dwellers depend on it. This step will self-destruct in five seconds. Good luck, gentlemen. <laughs> Self-destruct. Very dry. I appreciate the humour. I don't know what that means, but I don't think it's good. Damn it. 
Let me thank you. Right now, what else in here. Dude, you're really stocking us up here. Kind of pointlessly. You could have just given all this to us for free. In my opinion. One med kit, that's not good. Got no slime just yet, but there's going to be some. Thank you. How much the electricity on? Did we turn it on before we came in here? Alright, I'm waiting to see a librarian, man. Can hear him. Well, I'm going to be killing some this time, I think. Because we've got no way to distract them, have we? We can't throw stuff like with Artyom. And we've got a ton of ammo on the flamethrower. Right. Where are you, you damn dirty apes? Ah! Oh, that's a nostalgia. Is. Leave me alone, rat. Ha! Ah. Hello? Ha! Ah. Ha! Ah. I'm on edge. I'm here. System will reboot now. Hey, hey, I'm looting. Leave me alone. All personnel are to evacuate the complex immediately. All personnel are to evacuate the complex immediately. Attention. Reactor biological shielding is compromised. All personnel are to evacuate the complex immediately. Should I run? I want to run. All personnel are to evacuate the complex immediately. Biological shielding compromised. Initiating reactor shutdown. Attention. Reactor containment field. Bollocks. Reactor containment failure. Reserve power engaged. Bring it on. Oh, that was a waste. I didn't need any more. How do we open this? Flood of filth is about to come through. Defense. Hello there, friends. Ah! Hey, I've heard you.
Quick. Oh, sugar. I mean, Klebnikov. Shaitan! <laughs> Into the mine! All personnel are to evacuate the complex immediately. Hello there, friend. Reserve power engaged. Do you like fire? All personnel are to evacuate the complex immediately. Hey, I burnt you as well. Whoa! Ah, sugar. That was chaotic. Reactor containment failure. Reserve power engaged. Beautiful. Have I just crashed? I think the game's crashed. <laughs> All right, I am back. Let's hope this table doesn't glitch me out again. Must be where we're going in a second. Don't crash my game, please. I've got tons of med kits. Where'd they come from? Reactor containment failure. Reserve. Oh, we have got a uh, uh, new stuff. Give me more. Give me more. I don't think we had that initially, but we've got uh, got it now. I don't know if these guys have respawned. Yes. Choke point. If you want me, you have to come through this door. Oh! Oh, come on, dude. Looks like he's got the maps. Reactor containment failure. Reserve power engaged. Oh, I'm so jumpy, man. Yeah, they're being mullered. Uh, let's just quickly read a book. Stoker's diary number two. The old reports were correct. It does look like the reactor is still functioning. The place still has power. That reactor also seems to be leaking. Otherwise, where could all this radiation be coming from? That power doesn't make our lives much easier, though. Had it been regular, it certainly would. But as it is, it just comes on and off randomly and can't be relied on. The guys are already telling scary stories about the souls of the dead messing with the controls. It's all a load of crap, of course. This place is just... Oh, the place is just all rusty and rotten, so its machinery has gone awry. Hmm. All personnel are to evacuate the complex immediately. I think we're going to get librarians soon enough. 
Like, you can't kill them when they're on the wall. Like, it doesn't, like, stop them. All to the oh, are you serious? Oh, I should have... My fault for not Reserve saving. Power. Five map, there you go. Reactor containment Reserve power engaged. Reserve power field. Switching to main power source. F5 map, yeah. Matt. <laughs> I'm not getting bottlenecked. Can't tell what's going on. One of them's still alive. Don't need a health kit. That's the way forwards. This is bonus, maybe? Maybe we need the power on. What the hell? Oh! Stop bomb rushing me, man. How much fire? Oh, God's sake, dude. All personnel are to evacuate the complex immediately. Nice. Okay. Just a, a fiend entrance, right? A mutant entrance. Okay, left. All personnel are to evacuate the bottleneck them. On then. Oh! Reactor containment failure. Reserve power engaged. And this is really jumping, Image. making me jump, dude. I'm really motoring through these damn health kits. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Oh. It's just bum rushing me, man, and I can't see clearly. Well, like when you shoot the flamethrower, you can't see clearly at all. 
Librarians, yeah. Oh God! System reboot complete. Switching to main power source. What? Oh my God! I'm so scared. Reactor continued. <laughs> Shaitan! Help me out, big man! Get out of here. Hey. No windmilling. God damn it, Clevers. Burn him! Ow! Ah! Ah! The sprinkler system go off! Out of here. Ah! I didn't mean to change, I was trying to open the door. That's my last med kit, God almighty. Enough for you. Stop throwing guys at me. Oh. What are you doing? All personnel are to evacuate the car. Ah, I've been so loud today. I'm sorry. I'll do it all again. All right, let's do it. System reboot complete. Switching to main power source. Come on, quick. Reactor containment failure. Reverse power and Oh, that's nonsense, Dan. Quickly.
quick, 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 quick. No, no. Pick up the stuff. Am I supposed to escape at this point? Tough when we used Arty on one grenade, took him out. Blimey. O'Reilly. All personnel want to evacuate the complex immediately. Bruh. Well, that was stressful. Oh, we've not even got our flamethrower. Um, and we're trying to find our way out. We found a new note. Third entry of the Stalker's Diary. Good news, we've reached the archives. Bad news, the, ba the blind giants seem to have made it their lair. Luckily, there was nobody home, so we at least took a look around. The shelves are trashed, the maps are all in heaps. It's going to take us at least a few days to make anything out of this mess. And the new tenants could come back at any moment. Something tells me they aren't going to be all too happy to find us cataloging the archives without their permission. To make matters worse, radiation is off the scale in the archive. We spend five minutes there, then took a month's share of green stuff each, and I'm still queasy. I'll have to ask the colonel to arrange a bonus for us all, otherwise we'll all keep glowing in the dark for months. Of course, we grabbed as many maps as we could carry while we were there, let the guys at HQ sort them out. That, at least, would give them something to do. In any case, the mission is complete, is as complete as it ever could be, and if someone thinks he could do better he's welcome to try i for one am not setting a foot in that grave graveyard i guess grave ever again if i can help it now there might only be like five minutes left of this dlc i don't know but i had to end it last time it's alive Please don't collapse. Please don't collapse. This one's going to collapse. So on edge already. <laughs> I, think, I think this is going to be a bit emotional with, with, with Klemnikov here. I think I'm going to die from radiation poisoning. I think the guy said how high the levels were here. Please don't collapse on me, I have no weapons. Oh, I'm not in control. Let's go, Clevers. Oh, I don't 
There's bones everywhere. Guy's got it. Get it off him. All personnel are to evacuate the complex immediately. All personnel are to evacuate the complex immediately. Uh -huh. Biological field and compromise. Initiating reactor shutdown. Colonel, no. Yes, yes, yes. Green stuff. Wait. Could this Return be? Return power failure. Return to main power source. System reboot. Eliminate. Dude, look behind you. Come on now. Look out, Clepico. Get in. This is it. I found it. Gotta run. Oh, I was crouched. CPU spike then, sorry. of rest. I'm just so tired.
There you are, brother. You found the maps and took a break, I see. I need a breather, too. Boy, did these hunks of iron chafe. Gotta watch out not to stay for too long, though. Your son sent me here, told where to look. He's tough, your Kirill. Yes, I can see his effort. <laughs> Children, it's always about them. I'm here because of my daughter. She's smart, strong, kind, beautiful. I can't even tell you how proud I am of her and how much I love her. I'm trying to be a father, but end up a colonel. It's as if by showing affection, I'd also show my vulnerability. Not just to her, to her husband too. At first, I even thought that boy was all right. But his obsession with truth started driving me mad. He kept risking his life while he had the love of the best woman in the world. Decent people want normal things, a thicker broth, a warm place to call home, and healthy children. But he wants truth. Let me glance at those maps. Boy, was I mad at him. But then I took a closer look at the world and re-examined my life up to that point somewhat. Especially when I heard your story. I saw my past self in you, friend. We both served the great lie, because we both made ourselves believe it was necessary. And if not for him, I would have ended up like you did. But now, finally, my life has a real purpose for a change. All because I can finally look the truth in the eye. I think you understand. Thank you for the maps. Don't think it was all in vain. You saved us all. And Krill? I'll give him this watch and make sure he gets out of this hellhole. You have my word. Well, it's time. Farewell, Colonel Klipnikov. Rest easy. Dude, get your mask on. Artyom, stay with me. Hold on, son. They'll sacrifice themselves. And their children. All right. That was really enjoyable. I mean, the the, the opening bit with the flamethrower dragged on a bit, but once we got into the to the meat meat of the story, into the you know what happened and and uh, the colonel's relationship with Kirill and you know just the events that unfolded and the general and the kind of just awful situation that was at Novosibirsk uh, Metro and just how no one was ever going to make it out they were in just like a situation no one was going to survive and Yadil really is the only one I don't know I, I don't know if there was that initial small group who made it out of the command I'm not sure if the fact that the commander said his son had died meant that um that they'd been attacked or died already as well. So maybe no one made it out. Maybe Kirill is the only living, only survivor from Novosibirsk Metro. So yeah, really uh, enjoyable. Um, I, th I think they, they padded it out with that opening section with the, with the worms, but the story was nice and touching. Um, So yeah, I mean, the one thing I really love, I don't, you might have heard me go on about it in other games, but I love doing protagonists, 
and uh, Klebnikov, because we already knew he was going to die. He was essentially a, a Doom protagonist, and that is the thing I love the most in storytelling. I love someone who's going through it all, but then you know or they know that they're not going to make it, but they do it anyway for whatever purpose they have. There's always something kind of... And it doesn't necessarily have to be, you know, a violent death that they're, you know, um, leading themselves towards, you know, uh, you know, an end, some sort of end. Um, so yeah, that, I, I really enjoy that element in most stories. Uh, so yeah. All right, I think I'll leave that one there. Uh, I had separated this up into two other episodes, but this is only 15 minutes long, so I'll add it to the other uh, episode. So yeah, I hope you've enjoyed the Two Colonels DLC, guys. We'll be starting Sam's story straight away. So I hope you enjoyed it. Leave me a thumbs up if you did. Just remember, everybody, never trust an uncrate. I'll see you in Sam's story.